Hey guys! It's lovely weather outside. It's really hot. I think it's the hottest day so far. Quite hot for the poor guinea pigs. So I'm going to give them their frozen water bottle now. That's the first frozen water bottle of the year and I hope it's going to cool them off a bit. Little one for whatever reason, he just can't figure out how to not get hot. Like he often sleeps in corners where it's just extremely hot, like corners the other guinea pigs avoid if it's hot outside and little one just always sleeps there. So he really needs the water bottle to cool off. Sylvester loves it as well. So I'm going to get that now. Wrap the bottle in the towel because you don't want the guinea pigs to get too cold, but And then just put it in their cage and if they want to they can just snuggle against it if they don't want to they don't have to but it's them a while to figure out how it works but they usually get it pretty fast because as you can see they start sniffing at it and then they realize that that thing is giving off cold a new package of hay has arrived because the guinea pig's hay was empty and i think sylvester is going to be really excited when he sees that when it's 30 degrees outside and you're a guinea pig and you're just super hot because you have massive amounts of fur that's what pebbles is thinking right now Sylvester is already ready for some hay. I think Sylvester recognizes the package opening because I usually, for obvious reasons, don't get packages which are that big and I feel like Sylvester knows when he gets his hay because I haven't even opened it so it can't smell that much but Sylvester seems to know that he's getting new hay. Sylvester, oh stop teeth chattering, you're getting your hay, I stopped talking now. Look, they got new strings. They used to be blue and now they're kind of purple. That's cool, that's a nice surprise. Hey, Sylvester. Sylvester, I think he would love to move into this thing. By the way, if you're wondering why there's this Tupperware in the guinea pig's cage, I just put the camera on top of this thing. It's not part of that cage setup. The reason why they're so excited, well, they're always excited for new hay, but the reason why they're so excited this time is because I ordered it too late because there was a bank holiday last week, which obviously meant that the mail service didn't deliver and their hay was empty, so I had to buy them hay from the supermarket. And the quality of the hay from the supermarket isn't that great. Um, it's okay. Um, it's definitely okay for eating it for a weekend, but Sylvester. He's very picky when it comes to his hay and he doesn't like low quality hay. So every time I gave them the hay from the supermarket, the other guinea pigs were eating it and then Sylvester just stood there with teeth chattering. If it isn't up to his standard, he gets pretty grumpy and then he usually starts annoying the other guinea pigs because he's never grumpy unless his hay isn't perfect. <laughs> so yeah, now they got the hay um, from a farm. It's really green, it's really long, it's really thick. It's just great.
Hi, Sylvester. Wilma seems kind of nervous because the hammock is bothering her, but she's also not willing to move, so... <laughs> See? It's really bothering her because it's on top of her head, but willing to move even two centimeters, so... Wilma, the hammock is going to keep bothering you unless you move. The little one is kind of angry that I didn't give them food. But I'm going to give you guys food, I have something. I'm Sylvester. Oh great, the camera focused on the hay pieces instead of on the guinea pigs. Great! <laughs> Alright, so I have some... Alright, so I have some reddish green for the guinea pigs. Reddish is often too spicy for the guinea pigs, so they shouldn't really have it. Green they can eat and they really enjoy it. And are you hungry? You appear kind of hungry. Oh, Freddy! No. Look how nicely they're sitting in a circle. I swear every time I give them something to eat they just pretend they haven't been fed for the past three weeks. It's really not that often that I get all five of them on the camera without any of them making any sudden movements. What Frida, you're not happy with what I gave you? No. Wilma seems really happy. This is going to be it for today's vlog. I hope you enjoyed it and see you guys next time. Bye!